Sinta is sort of a den mother to a very busy den. Since this is her permanent home, it's her job to welcome and look after all of the residents who pass through. Today, some tiny new kittens arrive. This teeny trio was found with no mom in sight. Since they're too young to go to a regular animal shelter, they'll stay here until they get a bit bigger. Among this pile of black kittens is one little tuxedo named Oreo. Oreo is the smallest of the bunch, but he's got a pretty big voice. He's hungry for dinner, and he's not shy about asking for it. With no mom to feed them, the kittens get nutritious formula in a bottle. Blended and warmed to order. At this age, most kittens nurse constantly. So these little guys get bottle fed about six times a day. Oreo tries to drink every last drop. But when you're this tiny, every task is a challenge, especially when there's no mom to guide you. But little Oreo seems to have landed in good hands. It's been an exhausting day, and with a full tummy, the tiny tuxedo can finally get some sleep. Little Oreo is now the center of kitten attention. His litter mates have been placed in another foster rescue. But he's too tiny to move on and stays for some extra TLC, which Santa the dog seems happy to deliver. There are lots of furry creatures here, but Oreo is on the hunt for one in particular, a new mother. Here's a possibility. Oreo makes his best efforts to say hello. But the big kid doesn't seem to want anything to do with this tiny tag-along. There's that fellow. He's furry and big enough to be a mother. But he's not listening at all. Here's someone who looks familiar. It's Nellie, a three-week-old orphan skunk. She wears a tuxedo like him. but doesn't smell quite right. The search for a new mother is hard work, and Oreo's not getting far with these guys. But when he least expects it, someone steps up to answer Oreo's call. Sinta looks after everyone who lives here. She's awfully big but she sure is nice. Maybe Sinta would make a good mom. She may not be a mother cat, but when you're a tiny rescue kitten, it never hurts to have friends in high places. It's a new day at the rescue house, and tiny tuxedo Oreo awakens to an amazing sight. 
It's the very thing he's been looking for, a mother cat. Her name is Ginger. And these are her kittens, Chester and Murray. Oreo watches in awe as the new family settles in. Ginger seems like a wonderful mom. Perhaps she's got room in her heart for one more kitten. Oreo introduces himself. But Ginger is distracted by something she's never seen before. It's Nellie the skunk, and her lunch smells really good. Nellie's good at sharing, but Ginger is not. Meanwhile, Oreo tries to work his way into the family. If he can't get in with their mother, he tries the next best thing. And that's how Oreo finds himself two new brothers. Over at the rescue house, there's excitement in the air. Some new residents are arriving, and everyone is eager to meet them, including tiny tuxedo Oreo, who's not so tiny anymore. As they start to make themselves at home, Oreo notices there's one kitten who's looking a little lost. Oreo knows just what to do. This time, he's the one looking out for a tiny newcomer. <laughs> 